Hey y'all, what's good my MVPs? I'm back in the building and I just want to come and have a little chit chat with y'all. Let y'all come along and celebrate me, celebrate God's goodness, God's grace, God's mercy. God just being exceedingly and abundantly of what I and you can ask or think. But before we get into all the good, good news, I just want to welcome all the new subscribers. I hope that you enjoy yourself here. And for everybody that's been rocking with you, get hey, I appreciate you guys. You guys been rocking with me since the ups, the downs, the turnarounds, everything. So you know what? I just want to take this moment to let you guys know that I appreciate you. I could not made it this far without you guys alongside the God, okay? If you're watching this content and you have not subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscription button. You never know what you're going to get up over here, okay? Without further ado, you guys, I just want to come and let you guys know that God is real. For those of you who don't believe that God is real, I am a living testimony that God is real. I am a living testament. Do you hear me? God is good. God is faithful. God is just. God does exceedingly and abundantly of what we can ask or think. For the, some of you that view my video a couple of weeks back, when I told you guys that my background had came back and it denied me for a job, come to find out it wasn't even that. You know what I'm saying? And I was thinking it was one thing, and it wasn't even that, y'all. It was something totally different. They just decided to go with a different candidate. But God being God, you know, sometimes our prayers, our hopes, and our desires be holed up in Persia. And delay is not denial. Sometimes God just making sure you do a little rattle, dazzle, a little extra this and that, so it work out for our good. And when I tell you God did exactly that for me, I am so grateful. I am so thankful for his faithfulness. God is faithful. And I can't always tell you that I've been faithful because I don't like their progress, you know what I'm saying? But it's some things I just won't do, and it's some things I stopped doing because I, I've i experienced his faithfulness. I've experienced his grace. I've experienced his mercy. So it's just some things I ain't going to do, y'all. But I'm just so grateful. I am so thankful for you guys. I'm so grateful for this new season I'm about to adventure into, you guys. I'm just grateful that God answers prayers. He is a prayer-answering God. And not only that, he blesses us with our highest desires. I'm like, when I tell y'all my cup is overflowing, it is overflowing. Do you hear me? I'm in the process trying to get everything together because I do start my new position on July 14th. And it's like I'm trying to get my house in order. I'm trying to make sure that the children are being prepared for school. It's just so much transitioning going on in my house, y'all. And I'm so grateful and so thankful. But I promised you guys everyday videos in the month of July. And I'm going to do that. I am going to stand firm on what I told you guys. I can't guarantee they're going to be long videos. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to bring it. It's going to be a variety of videos. I hope and pray you guys partake in the videos. We're still on this journey to 1K, y'all. 4K. Help me get there. You know what I'm saying? If you enjoy what you see here, go ahead and hit that subscription button if you haven't already. Also, go ahead and hit that like button. Hit the share button. Leave me a comment. Say hello. I say it back. You know what I'm saying? Don't be real. You know? But, you guys, I am just so grateful. I am so happy. I am just, like, when I tell y'all my cup is running over, it is running over. Because sometimes when I feel like I'm... Last, God be like, uh, oh, those that are last shall be first. You know what I'm saying? He allows me to know that he has me, he has my babies, that he hasn't brought us this far to leave us, that he has our back, that he is carrying us through day to day. When I tell you guys we have not missed a beat ever in our lives, we have never, ever missed a beat. When God says he's never seen the righteous forsaken nor his seed begging bread, I am a living testament of that. I've never been forsaken. I, my children have never begging bread. Now, has it been moments that God had to humble me and teach me some lessons? Absolutely. Because sometimes we can be too um, reassured if that's the proper pretense to use. And what I mean by that is like, 
I'll be like, oh, God got me. Oh, I'm good. I'm covered in the blood. But then sometimes, you know what I'm saying, that's kind of being prideful. That's been haughty. That's been high in spirit. God says low and humble is the way. So it's been times that throughout my journey that God has has humbled me. And baby, it seems like when you learn your lesson, it's like things turn around, turn around, turn around. Do you hear me? Because I'm not going to even lie to y'all. Like, if I feel like um, institutions don't um, reciprocate what I bring to the table, I'd be like, what you going to do, another one to do. You know what I'm saying? And in a sense, that was me moving in pride. And God does not like pride. Like, no flesh will glory in his sight. You know what I'm saying? So it's been times God has had to humble me to let me know you only you only are existing because of me. You know what I'm saying? And then when we acknowledge that, when we stand on our faith, when we stand on God's Jesus and God's sacrifice, because God sacrifices only begotten Son, that we may be forgiven for our sins, past, present, and future. You know what I'm saying? And Jesus laid down his life willingly for us. You know what I'm saying? And then he sent his spirit to help us through this journey. So how dare we be ungrateful or be prideful or be haughty in spirit? You know what I mean? So, and all that getting, let's get an understanding. Make sure that we remain low and humble. Let's make sure we look to the hills which come with our help and our help comes from the Lord. Lord. Let's not think of ourselves more than we are. Let, let us just, in this season, let us just coast. You know what I'm saying? Coast. 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 And bask in the glory, but always remain humble, y'all. Okay? I didn't want much. I just wanted to come and check in and be like, hey. And let y'all know I'm here. Everyday videos in July. So be looking for your girl. If you haven't already, hit that subscription button. Hit that like button and share me out. You know what I'm saying? That helps me in the algorithm. Until next time, you guys, be kind, be sweet, be genuine, be civil. But most importantly, treat people the way you want to be treated. All right? Mm -hmm.